I mean, that, that's that's pretty much that's pretty much the only chance of him really being successful is catching McCrory with something big like that. Because but McCrory makes it easy for Paramount to do because he'll score up and try to fight with him in the trenches instead instead in terms of when in the beginning of the fight where he was trying to box and use his jab. He was fighting, he, you know, he was making it very difficult for Paramount to get out of return fighting and get hit. It. This is a little more traditional of a start here for McCrory, starting in his orthodox stance, working off his jab. I, if you ask me though, Christina, I feel that um, he's probably showing a, a little bit of um, fatigue. McCrory? Yes. Because he's, he's kind of slow. I mean, when you throw in big winging shots like that, it takes a lot out of him. Especially if you're not throwing it, those shots from the legs and you just, it's, it's more of arm punching. Excellent point. That takes a lot out of you. So he could be, you know, taking a breather and, you know, and, and scaling back a bit in this round. And in the last year, he's only had one fight. In, in McCrory, I mean, he fought last year in August, then he fought once in November, and that only went two rounds. Right. So in the last year, he's fought two professional rounds to date. So, I mean, he had a great training camp. Everybody does, right? At least that's what everybody said. Had the best training camp. Hello, yeah, yeah, hello. I'm in a tremendous shape. I'm in the best shape. <laughs> we all had the best training camp. The best one fight. Exactly. Until we talk after the fight, and then the realness comes out. I didn't. But, I didn't. I didn't perform at my right. best in training. Right. But but nonetheless, I mean, especially here in Fairmont. Oh my goodness. That shot has Paravon down for the second time. Looks like Paravon said he was off balance. It just went down Timber like very slowly. Let's take a look at that one on the replay, but it doesn't look like it did much damage there. He was already down in round two, round oh. five. McCoy looking to seal the deal here in round five. Oh, that left hand touch. Yeah, 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 Absolutely. Touch. That there legit knocked down again here in round five. So just when we're talking about McCrory, maybe showing some brief signs of fatigue, he gets back into the orthodox stance yeah. this round and does his best work, looking to there stop Paramon, and there it is, yeah. sits him right on his behind in the corner, like he's on timeout. Good round round five, knockout victory for Patrick McCrory. He heard us. Man, man, I, I hope he did. Well, because I was a bit worried, y'all. I'll be ready on some of that presence. <laughs> he turned it up. But I, I mean, you can even tell how we started that round. Right. He got back in that orthodox stance. He started he working boxing. off the jab. He went back to boxing just like you called for. And he got that stoppage there in round five. Oh, ooh, yeah. Those some, some clapping shots. Take a little step back. Bam. He's getting some, some space for that for, for that knockdown. And that was part of the problem too. When they both squared up and they were going at it, there was no room to work. They were smothered. Like, 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 like that is how they were just smothering each other. But by then, her problem was just, he was just off balance. He didn't get his legs up, 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 up under him. And, you know, because you can clearly see he tried to walk it off there, there in that sequence. And right there, which is the closer. Referee seen enough. His, his legs were just gone. So he maintains or retains, excuse me, his WBC International Silver title. Gets the knockout victory against the journeyman, former world title challenger in Paravon. Probably moves up the rankings, but still at this point in his career, this now is 14th professional fight. Still some things to work on, but turned it up and got the TKO victory in the fifth round. Let's make this one official in the ring there. The official time of two minutes, 14 seconds on round number five, declaring your winner by TKO.